So my pile heads up GPS speedometer died. But well, didn't really die. It just lost some <clears throat> digits. Um, I like this one because it reflected on my uh, window. Now, I have the same problem a lot of you guys have that have uh, uh, hot rods and not bot rods. I have a problem of speedometer accuracy and yeah right now I don't even have my speedometer hooked up but my speedometer accuracy because I have a 390 rear end uh, turbo 400 you know all kinds of reasons why these things aren't accurate anymore and uh, plus I don't like having the you know connection uh, but I really like this thing I bought it in 2018 and it has served me well for many, many years for $34. I noticed that they have gone up in price uh, for this particular uh, seller. I think it's like $49 now for the exact same one. So I went to go buy a replacement. And being an inexpensive, cheap kind of guy I am, I found this one. So this one... Um, look like something I might like so when I hadn't got it uh, it's kilometers how do I get rid of that though oh it's got some maybe I hold the button down I could read instructions but that would you know oh there we go there we go miles per hour all right now how do I get back out well, that doesn't get me out oh this right here is I know this from the other one Let's say you have your Waze app going and it says you're at 68 miles an hour and you match it exactly to your uh, car and you feel that that's right and then you get in your hot rod and it, uh, I'm sorry, you run it against Waze and it's not the same uh, against like an app like Maps or something. If it's not the same, you can go in there and change it. You can, you can adjust negative one, negative two, negative three. You can off. It's a little bit of a tweak to get it to match whatever you know you want it to match. So if you're confident the the Waze app or Google Maps is is accurate, you can make these things be identical to those things. So if there's a question about these being accurate, you can always tweak them. So that's good. Now let's see what happens when I shut it off. Because if it comes back with kilometers, I'm going to be pissed. All right. Oh, god dang it. Why did I pull my key out in the first place? All right. It better come back with uh, miles per hour or I'll be a little P.O. Because this one remembers miles per hour. This one here. Like I said, my seven segment display is missing the first digit. So, you know, if 10 mile an hour, one mile an hour, or whatever that is, is not accurate. Uh, but, like I said, I kind of liked it reflecting off of the, the screen. Uh, I mean off of the glass, but you know anyway, there was a bunch of different options this guy here well, I think it was $12.99 on Amazon or something. Oh, I'm sorry. I think, I think it was 14 But I'm gonna link it to the TikTok shop one just like it or the same same one and yes It remembered miles per hour. It's even got a compass. What more could you ask for for a 50 year old car guys? Now where am I gonna put it? I bet this sucker would fit right there <laughs> and still get a good signal in my experience. And one thing about these old cars is this, damn birds, these glass, this glass is not UV protected like it is in newer cars. So it is like 400 degrees up there. And, but like I said, this pile company, that is 2018 sitting up there day in, day out melting you'd think it would be just melted by now and nope it still functions perfectly 
it functions perfectly and except for that damn LED that went out everything works from 2018 till now can I say the same for the one I just got for $14 I do not know I will let you know but just to give you guys you know some of there, there's other options out there um, I could glue this you know somehow uh, speaking of glue I sprayed this with bed liner adhesive I mean headliner adhesive and it's all bumpy and I got to redo this whole dash because it, it looks like crap and it's not the dash that's bumpy it's wherever the glue was so it's the type of vinyl I, I used I think so I had a different kind of vinyl wrap before and it didn't do that so mm. anyway long ass video uh, get you one of these guys uh, I'll give you the link uh, to Amazon or you can just find it yourself or maybe I'll find a link I don't even know if the sellers sell it on TikTok shop or not I'm not trying to make any money I'm just letting you guys know pile one works good I can give it a lot of I mean look at that that long and it didn't warp okay it did warp a tiny bit it looks like but it didn't melt and it still functions it's just that damn LED right there it doesn't work um, maybe this one will blow up in a month but that one lasted many many years so there you go